of the following problem. Uh, we're going to use the quotient rule. So what's going to happen here is we'll take the derivative of the top. So that's going to be cosine x times the bottom, which is 1 plus cosine x minus the derivative, well, times the numerator times the derivative of the bottom, which is going to be derivative of 1, 0, derivative of cosines, negative sine x. And then we'll have this all over 1 plus cosine x. Okay, so this becomes, let's see here, cosine x plus cosine squared x. And then the minus sine x times minus sine x becomes sine squared x. All right, and this is a, well, I got the denominator here, so 1 plus cosine x. Uh, this right here is a trig property. It's equal to 1, so we end up with cosine x plus 1. Um, this should be, something's not right, 1 plus, oh, <laughs> sorry, you're supposed to square the denominator as part of the quotient rule, so we got cosine um, x plus 1, 1 plus cosine x, or cosine x plus 1 is the same thing. Uh, Divide, take one out here because this is two of these down here so it just becomes one and we're simply left with one over cos one plus cosine x and that's it all right i hope this helped you out appreciate you watching this video and you have a great day